right, so lofty expectations for this matchup as round one gets underway. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but on the other, truly a fighter who can do it all. And that guy will usually have the advantage on paper. When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Let's get with those hands. Right hand on point. Oh, effective strike there by Lee. Nice job of hiding that head kick. Throws the right hand there. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Oh, nice job there to land the knee strike to the body, again making great use of his length in this matchup. Oh, and he lands yet another knee, and sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Well, one got through, that kick was blocked. Oh. Spinning back fist. Kick to the body now, that one won't land. Big kick lands. Tags him with the uppercut. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Lee gets caught with that punch. Under three minutes remain in round one. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. Nice job by the fighter here to continue to block the shots coming his way. You think he's trying to sort of fatigue his opponent here a little bit? He's kind of watching and seeing everything that's happening in front of him. Later, you'll see him start to throw counters after blocking shots. All right, so the taller fighter lands a knee, and Daniel Cormier to my right, I can hear him saying, I wish I was a little bit taller. Oh, what a punch. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Do not back up. Let's go forward now. Back and forth we go. Oh, he lands a huge knee to the body. That's a crippling shot there. Looking to land the right just out of range. Kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Nice job with that follow-up shot as well. there to block the shot. Nice instincts. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Digging kick. And then he throws an overhand right. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Great punch landed with so much power. 20 seconds to go. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. Oh, he lands that team. Cable inches right there, boy. Wow. 
All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and I'd imagine a lot of these replays are gonna be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're gonna see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. Nice strike. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Counters with a straight left. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, <laughs> if you're gonna sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. Big head kick. Just misses with that one. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Just misses there with the left. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. We march on three minutes to go. That strike blocked by Lee. Oh, and there he goes working off that jab again. How's your jab? I mean, the jab's nice. I love throwing the jab. But you realize that as MMA evolves, guys will start to fight behind a very educated jab. It's just like boxing. The most thrown punch in the first one you learn is a jab. Right. And in MMA, guys are starting to take that same approach because it is such an effective weapon. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Bone on bone as the head kick lands flush. He better get those hands up or he's gonna put him to sleep. The right hand just misses. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Lands a knee there. Nice deception there to get that knee to the target. Really good knee. Nice job of driving it right to the target. Getting it to land exactly where you want. Oh, damage done. Bleeding from his cheek now. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Lee going for the leg kick. He does not connect. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. They continue to exchange. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Lee gets caught with that punch. Ooh, blocks the shot. What a tricky head kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Big head kick lands. Big punch lands through the middle. Oh, body kick attempt here, it's no good.
20 seconds to go round two. 15 seconds to go. Watch knees to the body. Final seconds here of round number two. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. All right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC. And uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding. And look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel. He's really trying to damage his opponent. And as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. Nice straight punch. Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. This guy's making sure nothing lands. Oh, that straight punch is going to be a real problem if they can't make the adjustment. A real problem. He needs to move his head defensively if he's going to avoid getting hit so many times in the face. Just misses with the jab. And he connects there with a the punch, so pretty good striking display by a muscle. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He blocks the punch. Get those combinations going. Move those hands. Oh, looked like he might have been in range, but misses with the kick. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, nice knee to the body. Very nice. He understands that doing the body work will pay dividends the longer the fight goes. Oh, and he caught the kick. And they separate. Oh, big one. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent run very bad. Kick attempt, it's blocked. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter. Take the judges out of it. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Oh, man, head to land. All right, well, it's late in the fight. Whoa! Oh! Look at the commitment to kick it in this fight. There's no tell on that leg kick. Oh, nice ball. Oh. Cable inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Vicious combo there. Shots being landed on both sides here. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Straight right, he misses. Sneaky head kick. Defensively blocks the shot. 
Right under the elbow of Mikey Lane. Back to the jab now, no good. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Nice punch, Lynn. There's that patented head kick. 20 seconds to go in the fight. 15 seconds remain in the round. Liver kick. Final seconds Holy of the fight. So the fighters go the distance here tonight, but it went a whole lot better for one of them than the other. Talk us through the replay, champ. Some decisions are different than others, and his striking really did separate him from the competition. He fought so well in the stand-up game that he should get a very easy decision.